In today's short, we are going to learn how to unlock locked mechs. It has been 30 days since the launch of the Maya exchange, therefore, the people who claimed free mechs for holding e-gold throughout April and July of 2021, can unlock a percentage of that locked mechs. Here are a few things to keep in mind before deciding if you want to unlock it right away. First, you can unlock it at any point in time, it can be now, or it can be 3 months from now, so there is no rush there, in case the next point will make you want to keep it as locked mechs for a time. Second, the unlocking process is a manual one, and you will have to withdraw your liquidity, if your unlockable locked mechs is inside an eGold mechs LP token. Similarly, you will have to unstake your locked mechs, if the unlockable locked mechs is staked in a staking farm, such as the mechs farm or the ride farm. Keeping it as locked mechs will allow you to participate in farming new tokens that will be listed on Maya Exchange. Just as we saw with the ride token, a special locked mechs farm was created for it, where you can stake locked mechs and farm ride. These staking farms expose you to limited risk, as there is no impermanent loss that can happen here. It is similar to staking e-gold, where you simply lock your tokens in a smart contract and receive interest on them. These farms are usually active for a limited period of time. The same will be true for new tokens that will be listed on the exchange. A special farm may be created for them, where you can stake locked mechs and farm that new token. So now that we have this information, and we can make a decision that suits our needs, we will show you how to unlock your locked mechs. First, we of course go to Maya.exchange and we will click on connect on the top right. Choose your preferred wallet here and connect to the exchange. We will connect with the Elrond Web wallet. Now that our wallet has been connected, we will assume your locked mex is staked inside a farm. Either in a simple farm, like the mex farm or the ride farm, or in the eGold mex LP token which can be staked in the eGold mex LP farm. Let's navigate to the farms section on Maya exchange. For starters, let's assume some of your unlockable locked mex is staked in the mex farm. If you click and expand the farm, you can hover over the little I icon to see the release schedule on your staked locked mex. If you have any that is unlockable, it will show you how much you can unlock right now. But, in order to unlock it, we need to have the locked mex available in our wallet, so we will have to withdraw it from the mex farm. So let's go ahead and do that, click on the withdraw button right here. In this part, you will want to withdraw all of your locked mechs, if you want to unlock all of it that is unlockable. But as we do not want to unlock our locked mechs, we will just withdraw a small portion, enough to show you how it is done. So I will manually type in to withdraw 50,000 locked mechs tokens. Again, make sure to withdraw all of it, if you want to unlock all your unlockable locked mechs. We will click withdraw, sign the transactions, and wait for them to complete. Now that we have unstaked our locked mechs from the mechs farm, we will be able to see it available in our wallet and Maya exchange account. We can click on our Maya Exchange account here, and expand our Locked Mex Tokens field. The first option for us is some Locked Mex Dust, so we can ignore that. But below, you can see the 50,000 Locked Mex that we withdrew from the Mex farm. The reason why it is split in 16,800 Locked Mex and 32,800 Locked Mex, is due to how the Locked Mex merges inside a farm when you reinvest your Locked Mex rewards, and so forth. In any case, we see there is an unlock option that we can click on. We can click on that, sign the transaction, and it is that easy. Now that the transaction has been completed, we can click again on our Maya Exchange account, and we can see the available mechs in our wallet. If you also have locked mechs that is staked in the ride farm, you can click to expand the farm, and hover over the little I icon to see if you have unlockable locked mechs there too. The process will be exactly the same, you will withdraw your locked mechs from the ride farm to receive them in your wallet, after which you will click unlock on that locked mechs in the Maya exchange account. A similar process will apply if you have locked mechs inside the eGold mechs LP token. Assuming your eGold mechs LP token is staked in the eGold mechs LP farm, you will click to expand the farm, check if you have unlockable locked mechs by hovering over the little I icon, and then proceed to withdraw the LP token from the farm. After the transaction is successful, the eGold Mex LP token will show under My Liquidity in the Liquidity section. 
We will need to remove our liquidity, and we will receive e-gold and locked mechs back, which will be available in our wallet. We already know what to do from here, we open up our Maya account and click unlock on our locked mechs. Before we say goodbye, we would like to say that we have a queued node on position 12. After that node gets out of the queue and becomes active, our APR will improve. However, we are close to losing the node, and we would like to ask for your help to keep that node alive. Consider staking with us if you would like to support us, and once the node goes active, our APR will greatly improve. Feel free to also follow us on our socials and join our Telegram channel. We also want to hear from you, our community. Drop us a comment below, tell us your thoughts, and tell us what video and subject would you like us to cover next. And if you want to support us in this journey, consider liking this video and subscribing to our channel, and of course, consider staking with us. This will allow us to continue providing valuable content for the community, to do it consistently, and to do it better each time. Until next time, Mountaineers!